Introducing Deluxe Materials Tissue Paste For the wrinkle-free application of tissue paper In this short video we show you how it gives a wrinkle-free finish, strong hold and is safe and clean to use with both cellulose and easy dope. So the object of the exercise today is to cover this wing with this tissue. What we have is a bristle paintbrush, a couple of sheets of uh, kitchen roll, a new razor blade, a small bowl of water, some deluxe materials tissue paste, the tissue and the wing. Prepared the wing by sanding it and sealing it. I've already covered the lower side, today we're going to cover the top side. On the tissue I've cut it about one to one and a half centimetres bigger than the wing itself, as you can see there. There's a smooth side and a rough side, that's the smooth that's the rough. You may not be able to see it on the video, but you'll see it when you get the tissue for yourself. I've tested the grain by just ripping the end of it very, very slightly. And I can see that in this case, the grain is running down the tissue, which is the way I want it. Um, I cover with a shiny side in. Some people cover shiny side out, but keep it the same for the whole of your model, but whatever you do. Tissue paste. I'm going to run this around the edge. I'm going to cover this panel first. And because of the way the tissue paste is sold, we have a very nice applicating tube on the end, which allows me to put a very fine bead of paste all the way around the edge of the model. I'm using my finger just to guide it. I'm trying not to get it too far into the model itself or into the wing, just trying to get it on the edge. I'm going to put some down on that side. I then spread the tissue paste with my finger all the way around the wing like so and I want it to stick underneath as well as on top so I'm running my finger with the tissue paste on it over the edge of the parts that I'm intending to cover so running it around the back so I've got a little bit of tissue paste around the back of the wing. I then wipe off the surplus on my hands, that's got rid of one of the sheets of cloth. So, shiny side down it is, I'm going to lay that on the top gently and then press it into place. You can see that it's wrinkling but I don't really mind about that. I'm going to hold it with a thumb there and pull it taut and just move it down with my thumb just here. I've now stretched it lengthwise. I'm now going to gently pull it and press it down on the edges cordwise. That's cordwise, that's spanwise, just for argument's sake. So you can see it's wrinkling here. I'm not really fussed about that, but it is sticking. And I'm wrapping it carefully around the edges. Once I've done that, I then wet my finger on the water and run it round the edge. That does several things. Surface tension of the water pulls the tissue onto the model. It also expands the tissue very slightly around the edge uh, while it's wet. When it's dry it'll shrink and it'll put it onto the airframe. The reason I have the brush is to just push the tissue into the uh, into the wing where it meets the centre section. I'm now going to carefully run the razor blade along the edge of that to cut the tissue so I can then pull that away. I then have the tissue exactly the right shape to run into the, the root of the wing. It's going to ease it out a little bit. You'll see that it's wrinkling on all of the edges where I've wet the tissue. Again, I'm not overly fussed about that because as it dries, it'll shrink and pull into place. I'm just going to rub over the edges. Because the tissue is wet around here, I can pull it in and roll it underneath. Same just here. Now on the wing tip, You'll see that it's wrinkling in that point there and it's not sticking here. I'm going to wet the tissue over the edge of the wing. That'll cause it to expand very slightly. 
So when I pull it down gently and pull it tight, that will stretch the tissue so that as it dries and shrinks, it'll dry to the shape of the wing and those wrinkles should disappear. So just to check that I've got the tissue stuck along the edges, stuck down on the end. And I lay it down and leave it to dry. That's it. Thanks for listening. Why not ask for Deluxe Materials Tissue Paste by name? And keep up to date by visiting and registering with the Deluxe Materials website and YouTube channel.